Hello everybody. This is Wednesday, August 28th. Time is 9.45. Kind of overcast day and we got a 15 degree Celsius temperature. Okay, I'm here at the library, the main library in Halifax, so the, the biggest one. And there's a protest going on here today and there's a, I don't really <clears throat> blame them. Usually I don't endorse one side or the other, but today I see the side of the employees that work at the library. There's a lot of people that work here and they do put up with an awful lot of nonsense from people. And the wages aren't compatible. There's a lot of things. I'll see if I can find some people here to uh, interview. All right? As I walk around, I'll, we'll see if we can get anybody to make some comments. Uh, on the, on the <coughs> on how it looks for the people that work here. <coughs> All right, and we will. I'll start somewhere around here. I was talking to some people a while ago, and they went to get some people to uh, to interview. So I'm waiting around, but I might be able to talk to somebody else. In the meantime, we'll see if I can <clears throat> find some people interested in uh, talking to me today. We will try our best to see what we can do here. <coughs> Hello. I, I make YouTube videos and stuff. Would you be interested in saying anything about your what, about the situation here? Yeah, sure. Where, uh, what uh, YouTube page is it? I go by Halifax Walker. I walk around the streets talking about stuff. And I'm, 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 I live right here in Halifax. So, yeah. so if you could want to say something about things, how things are. You get many views? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I, I don't, I'm not way up there yet. But I've got about 1,550 subscribers. Yep. Okay. So. All right. So, so I'm here talking to a, a library employee, and uh, we're just going to ask him what what maybe led led to this where we are right now. What what, what happened? Stubbornness. Determination. We uh, tried to reach an agreement, but we couldn't reach an agreement. So uh, I think enough was enough after a while, and uh, we just kind of had to go on strike. All right, that was good. What about what about? I read something in the paper a while ago of a, around my news on my phone about people coming in and causing trouble and stuff like that. At the picket line? It, it could have been here, it could have been the other libraries, I'm not sure. Not that I've heard. Okay. No, maybe, uh, like, people, I got cursed at yesterday. Yeah, at that's Alderman. what I mean, okay, that yeah, kind yeah. of stuff, so yeah. I got cursed at yesterday at Alderney, but, I mean, <laughs> that's like one person out of a hundred people that I've seen walking around the street, and uh, most people you see are honking and supporting us. Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I, know, I know I was reading the, all across Canada that some uh, library employees have been attacked, and... and Things happen like that by people coming in? Yeah, uh, not that I've seen here, but uh, mm -hmm. I'm sure it does happen in certain neighborhoods and stuff. Uh, I think like Halifax is a small city, so you don't see it happen yeah. that often. But maybe in a bigger city it would happen, but I yeah. can definitely see it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Well, uh, it's nice to hack into you. I hope you get this solved and then uh, everybody gets a big raise and, yeah. uh, and all that. Yeah. And the library continues. That's why we're here. I know. I come in here a lot. Sometimes I come in here and have a coffee in here. And I, and I watch TV for a while and yeah. read the books yeah. And, yeah. and all that. This so. is a big community resource that is being deprived from people, from the public right now. So yes. we want to get back. And know. there's a lot more than just a library. Yeah. You can come and go to the washroom and all that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's a... Uh, resource that needs to get back as soon as possible so as soon as we yes. can get well I wish you well I hope it all works out for you and the union sees it yeah, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay no thank you very much all right, thanks a lot hello I am a YouTube video maker in Halifax would you like to say anything about anything at all fair wages, <laughs> fair wages? Yes, fair that's wages. fair enough <laughs> yeah. well, Wow. 
Any idea when the library's open again? Uh, no. Whenever we get a fair deal. When they good. give you a big raise. Exactly. Well, I hope it happens. I hope so, too. I know. <laughs> I, was, I was just talking to another gentleman there and said, I, I read on my phone about a week ago, all across Canada, they're having a, a huge problem with people coming in and, like, hollering at employees and things like that. Has that happened here? Okay, yeah. All right, yeah, in some libraries, like in Toronto and places, they were attacked by, the employees were attacked by people. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So you need to be getting compensated for what you have to tolerate along with what, doing your work. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Well, very nice talking to you folks. I got a lot of people to try to get some comments and take care hello hey how's it going everything's good yeah, would anybody like to make some comments for youtube for sure, sure. all right i'm going to switch over my signs so it's not as inappropriate let's see have a look at that sign liberty heart soul community work with heart and soul the library all right cool okay, that's right hi my name is Shelby, and I have been working for Halifax Public Libraries for about seven years now. I think that a lot of people don't realize just how much work goes into library work. A lot of people say, oh, you, it must be fun to have your job because you probably read books all day. No way! We are working so hard. And in fact, we deal with a lot of really crazy stuff because we work with the public mm -hmm. and you know people come into our doors sometimes on the worst days of their lives and we do our best to take care of them a lot of that requires so much people skills soft skills and sometimes evasive action <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I really want people to realize just how much work we do how much uh, we put into the community and it's while it's rewarding work it should also be work that is rewarding uh, in monetary value as well um, we don't want to see our co-workers going to food banks we want to see everybody yeah, living yeah. Uh, on a living wage so please support the library workers thank you very much all right yeah yeah well said. And, and how about you me i just want to say that like if the mission of the library is to help people who are, as Shelby said, having housing insecurity, food insecurity, mm -hmm. the fact that such a large percentage of our workers are suffering from that themselves just seems a little unfair to me. Um, and I think it's also important to remember, it's not just about things like wages, it's also about staffing in terms of even safety. Yeah. Like, and this is not something that is hypothetical. You know, we're librarians, we're keen on stats. The number of like uh, incidents and stuff, including violent incidents, is yeah. up all over the country in public libraries. And our staffing has been reduced. It's not something that you need even to see from a spreadsheet. Like yeah. you can come in the central library and see like there used to be two staff on each desk, now it's one, yeah, right? Some yeah. staff, you know, some desks were left unstaffed, that kind of thing. It's like for this to actually be a safe space for everyone, it mm -hmm. has to be a safe space, yeah. period. Yes. And for me anyway, especially for the workers coming in behind me, I'm lucky I've worked here for a long, long time, 10, maybe 15 years. Oh, I've worked here almost long longer time. than I've not worked here. Yeah. Right? And I think it's important for me to like help everybody to stand up for their rights to a safe and welcoming workplace so that we can make it a safe and welcoming place for everybody. Wonderful. And I got to tell you about my good experience here. Yeah, please do. When I started doing, I've been doing it for a while, making YouTube videos, but it wasn't very good with the computer end. Could have fooled me, you look like a pro. Yeah. So I came in here and I went to the desk and I asked the woman, is anybody here can give me some free lessons on how to use a computer better? <laughs> she set me up an appointment, I went upstairs and this guy was really, really helpful. And I wrote it all down because I knew I wouldn't remember it all. So he showed me how to do a lot of stuff on the computer. Oh yeah. And no charge. No. Nope. It was it was uh, yeah. very, very good for me. Like I'm good at this end of it. But you got to go onto the computer and it got to be processed. Editing. And yeah. Hardest part. That's exactly yeah. it. Yeah. Same with music. Every yep. once in a while I'm walking around, somebody will get into it. I don't want to be on that. Can you take me out? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, think, well, I can't right now, but when it 
once I had one so bad I had to discard the whole video. Oh, yikes. Go back and do one again, and I didn't run into that person next time. Right. <laughs> Fair enough. Thank you so much yeah, for coming out. Oh, thank, thank you. Support. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I wish you all the best, and I hope you're. Thank you you're, so much. Hope Thanks the so library much. does all the things you want done. And, Crossing my finger. I read the article that was on my phone about about like in Toronto and places how the, That's the, right. yep. the employees were getting attacked by people. That's and, right. Yeah. Like I said, keen on stats. I got the numbers. Right here. Yeah, I read. I had that on my phone too. I read that. Yeah. That is. Yeah. And Halifax is pretty high. This is just yeah, just yeah. Halifax. And it's like, the thing is, you know, there's a bunch of libraries all around the system. Yes. But most of that is concentrated really on like three or four branches. Yeah. And they tend to yeah. be the ones that get ignored. I would say here, probably got it in. Yeah, uh, mm. Central, Halifax, North, Dartmouth, North, Spryfield. You know, I mean, I don't know what it's like at, People, the, at the ferry terminal one. I'm not sure I know uh, that. Yeah. It seems pretty quiet there. But. Well, and the thing is, like, to be fair, like people can come in having a bad day anywhere, for sure. Mm -hmm. But it's just like it doesn't seem fair to me that so many people have to be working in a place that's mm -hmm. not safe. Yeah, you yeah. know, every other like hospitals and other locations that might have people, yeah. uh, you know, experiencing pretty like critical emergencies mm -hmm. in their life have. You know, safety plans, they yes, have no security, yes. all of that stuff. Yes. Yeah, if you go into the hospital and do that, security guards will be on you. Then they'll call yeah. The police. yeah. And I mean, we do our best to make sure everything is like welcome for everybody. Like, yeah. We want everybody to be there. Yeah. We really do. I gotta say, some days, like if I'm if I'm just walking around here, I'll come inside and I'll watch some news or something on TV. And a lot of times, I'll get a conversation with somebody while I'm in there. And I never really noticed any any bad things any time I've been in there. It's been a good, a good experience, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's, we actually looked this up because when we were striking, we had to find out, you know, how many people we had to yeah. plan the strike. And what did it used to be? It was like 400, 400 and, and like three. Like 403 employees and now it's what? 300 and I don't know. 320 uh, or something like yeah. that? Yeah. So you're doing the same amount of work but le way less people. Way less people. Yeah, yeah. yeah, not to mention they put us through this restructuring a few years ago. So many people are actually doing uh, more work for less pay than they were before. That's mm. true. Yeah. Not yet, yeah, yeah. It's always nice to get a raise and uh, and the loss of yes, expertise. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. thank you very much oh, for I, your comments. Thank, yeah, you. Yeah. thank you for the support. Anything you'd like to say while I'm right here? Well, as I mentioned, part of the restructuring resulted in us losing some dedicated billets. So people who had specialized expertise, there's suddenly another blip on the spreadsheet. And so we've lost some of our capability. Mm. They went on to something else. And, uh, well, they were obliged to go yeah, on to something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Well, thank you very much. I hope this all works out and yeah, everybody, all. yeah, they, they see it your way and you get all what you need to have and, yeah. and everybody's back to work soon. And yeah, you do you do a lot of good service for people. We, we it, do our best. It's a lot more than books. Oh, oh. Much, much more than books, yeah. 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 It, the old image of the librarian just hungered behind it, just going shush, yeah. shush. Yeah. No, that's not how it works. Yeah, works. like I was telling the folks here, I. I'm pretty good on this end of it, but when it comes to putting it in the computer, and like, I, so I, I went up to the desk one day and I said, I don't know much about computer, but I just want to learn about like how to process the video and stuff like that, put it in the computer. And, hmm. and they, she set me up an appointment. I went upstairs to, with a guy that was really smart, kind of young guy, but he really smart on computer. And he taught me a whole bunch of stuff. I wouldn't remember it all, so I wrote it down and how to do things. And it's a big help. And it didn't cost me a cent. Yeah. All part of the service. Yeah. Anyway, take care. Have a good day. And you as well. Yep. yep. Hello. Any comments about the library and the strike? And... No, I'm no, sorry. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, I hope it all works out. Have a good day. Yep. Hello. Hello. Hi. 
Would anybody like it? I'm, I'm a YouTube maker, uh, and this will be going up in probably by maybe Monday. If you have anything you want to say about the library or your... Not for me right now, I don't know about these guys. Thank no you. complaints? Lots of complaints. <laughs> no comment right now. Thank you, though. I think I picked a shy crew here you today. Did. You did. You did. I did. They, they, they told me a lot. They did? <laughs> Yes. Oh, I was talking to them already. Were you? Yeah. yeah. And they did tell me some yes. things. Yeah. Okay, good. Well, I kind of understand it. It depends yeah. on how long you've been here and yeah. different yeah. things. Yeah. yeah. I know. All right. Well, take care. It's so yeah. nice to meet you and talking okay. to everybody. So I hope it all worked out and you soon get back in there. Yeah. Sooner the better. Yeah. 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 Okay. Take care. Bye. Bye. That's a nice sign. <laughs> That's the best sign I saw yet. <laughs> Anybody like to say anything in the comments? No. The song says it all. Uh, the song says it all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I have a question. Yeah. What is your parents' view on that? <laughs> I can't move what are my parents' at. Well, you just have to deal with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They haven't kicked me out yet. I'm just being funny now. Yep. Yeah. How, uh, any, any comments on the work and the strike and all that? Well, uh, I'm, well. A, I'm on one of the lowest level pay. Oh, okay. So my take-home pay is less than $1,000 per paycheck, but I'm full-time. Yeah, yeah. It's... You know, there's a lot of people who are... My son lives at home, mm -hmm. and he can't afford to move out. No. He's got a job. Yeah. He works every day, but he can't He can't move out. So... Yeah. <laughs> I'm retired now, so I don't yeah. care. But yeah. I care, but I don't care about what I, me and um, Right, yeah. Um, I, so anyway, I wanted to kind of get a feel for this. And I I live right here in Alfax, and I've got a lot of viewers. So right there. And hopefully somebody that can do something will watch the video. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see that. And see how people feel like, you know what? You know that you don't like the job. You like no. the job, but you want to get a fair, fair compensation. Yeah, yeah. No. as anybody would. Like, yeah, I remember yeah. when I, I, I worked as a truck driver a lot of my life. Mm -hmm. When I started out, I didn't make good money, and I felt really good when I got like a dollar an hour more than yeah. another dollar. Like it really, it really felt good. So I hope it all works out for you guys. Thanks. Take care. Have yes. a wonderful day. Thank and, uh, you too. Uh, I come in here a lot. Yeah. yeah. So take care. Well, there we are, folks. I think that's a pretty good idea what uh, people are, are doing here. And I hope they, I hope they uh, get the, all the grievances solved. I know it's not easy. That, but the job they do, they do a lot more than. Hand out library books. They do a lot more. They do, do way, way more. They do have classes in here with things and teach you a lot of stuff. Then they put up with a lot of people coming in angry and hollering. I don't know why they would do that, but they do. And so, anyway, that's, uh, that's about it for here, I guess. Hopefully those doors will be wide open before long. And 
everybody will be back back uh, into the library again and and that's great okay what else do I want to do today I'm not sure my mind took a blank I was I was gonna do something else while I was out here today but Got any comments about the strike? Uh, I would like it to end soon. Yeah, my, my uh, same, same thing. I always like to see it, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. for sure. We gotta make sure that all these people who are doing more and more and more for the community every day get paid with their work. I know, yeah, and I know you put up with a lot in here, too. Do. I was reading on my phone there about the libraries across Canada. Yeah, Toronto and places, like, it's awful. Yep. Yeah, I mean, we love the community, but we're dealing with some people who have big challenges, and sometimes, unfortunately, they take it out on us. Yeah, and it's too bad because you're only trying to help people. Exactly. It's, it's sad. Yeah, it is. I think a lot of the trouble is there's nowhere for people with mental issues to go, yeah. so they just come in here. Yeah. And you guys are doctors for that kind Not of stuff. Not the best stuff. place for that, yeah. but you are best. You can give them a book on it, maybe that'll help. <laughs> I gotta tell you my own personal experience with the library. Yeah. I, I make YouTube videos, but I'm not very good with a computer. So I came in one day and I went to the desk and I said, is there any free classes here on computers? She said, what do you want to know? I said, well, I make YouTube videos and I'd like to be able to put it on the computer and process it and and, right. and ship it out, all that, I can do it myself. Because yeah. right now, my, my son helps me, and but but I wanted to learn for myself. Yeah. And she set me up a class, and I went upstairs. There was this young guy there, he was really smart. And he told me all the stuff, how to do things. And I wrote it all down, because I knew I wouldn't remember it. And they were such a help. And it didn't cost me a penny. Yeah. So that was a positive experience. I'm glad you heard that. Yeah, yeah. Well, I hope you get everything you're Thank trying you. to do. Thank you. And everybody gets back to work. And I hope so, too. Thank you very much. I miss that hot coffee in there. <laughs> right? Thank See ya. All right, folks. That's it. I think we're, we've interviewed probably enough people here now on the front lines. That was very interesting. I hope... Uh, you enjoyed this video. We're going to end that one right there because that was a little over a half an hour. We had a great time walking around and meeting people and finding out about them and, and hearing their stories. I loved it. Love it. Love it. Okay, so now we're going to end this video right here. Hope you have a really great day. Take care. Be safe. Oh, and if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that kind of stuff. And, all right, enough of that nonsense. Okay, talk to you later. Bye.